Well, for the first time in more than three months, the country is starting to see a decline in coronavirus-related hospital admissions and daily cases. But uh, what are we seeing in Pennsylvania? Daniel Hamburg joins us now with more. Daniel. Well, Janelle and Mark, this is very good news, but doctors stress that we can't let our guard down just yet, especially in Pennsylvania, where cases are still climbing. Infectious disease doctors are still urging people to get vaccinated. The latest CDC data shows a decline of COVID cases in the U.S. as a whole, and it's projected to continue its plunge. But Dr. Anthony Fauci is warning we're not out of the woods yet. We certainly are turning the corner on this particular surge. But we have experience over now close to 20 months of surges that go up and then come down and then go back up again. A look at Pennsylvania's data doesn't show a decline yet, though projections show a plateau in the next few weeks. One of the most dangerous parts of mountain climbing isn't going up there. It's the descent. A lot of people get hurt and injured because they let their guard down. They try to rush through things. So it's very important that we continue um, doing all that we can to be protected uh, from COVID. And that means getting vaccinated. Cumberland Goodwill EMS Assistant Chief Nathan Herrig says diversion requests from hospitals have gone down, especially with the new one open in Cumberland County. But there's still stress on hospitals. They're releasing their numbers regularly and their numbers show that it is a unvaccinated population that takes up a lot of these bed space and intensive care resources. Herrig says being on the front lines prove the vaccines work. The people that we've encountered in EMS, they tend to be, uh, you know, diagnosed with COVID a week or two weeks prior and it progresses and it continues to get worse. And that's an unvaccinated population. Vaccination is our best defense against COVID-19. We have the scientific tools needed to put an end to this pandemic. There are approximately 70 million Americans who are not vaccinated. Public health experts say it's never too late to get your shot. In the studio, Daniel Hamburg, ABC 27 News.